All right, Coach, uh, coming off a 67-61 win today at Troy to improve 12-1 on the season, 2-0 uh, in Sunbelt play, and now uh, seven true road victories on the season. Just talk a little bit about today's win. Well, you know, I'm tired of getting off these bad starts and talking about how proud I am of our guys fighting back, but same old story tonight. I think as a coaching staff, we got to figure out how to get off to a better start, but get our players a lot of credit, you know, to be down five at half and then to win the game. I think we beat them 12 in the second half. And, um, had some good individual, you know, games tonight. Liz Soshi with three blocks, uh, Reese with 12 rebounds, Marcus Johnson scored the ball well, and then Jalen Jackson came off the bench and really scored in an efficient way. So a lot of great individual moments tonight, and then I thought the guys were playing as a team as well. Yeah, and that defensive effort in the second half, uh, limiting Troy to 6 of 23 shooting, 26%. They finished at 34.5% for the game. Just um, how would you guys uh, how would you get that type of play out of them in the second half? Well, that's the backbone of our team. You know, it's no secret. We, we like to play defense. We pride ourselves on our defense. You know, at halftime, we try to meet as a coaching staff and get some ideas and take the material to our players to help them. And we just couldn't come up with many adjustments. I mean, the adjustment was to get back and play Little Rock defense. And so we presented that information to the players at halftime. Really proud of the seniors. Again, Josh and Jermaine and Roger getting these guys to buy into what we were doing. I thought in the second half we settled down and we played Little Rock defense. And uh, you talked about the individual performances, Jalen Jackson, Liz Shoshi. Marcus Johnson, how much of that is you as guys as a coaching staff kind of working with those guys, and how much of it is those guys going out there and just making plays? Yeah, I give them all the credit. You know, like Jalen Jackson, he's not known to be a three-point shooter, but Jalen puts in a lot of time. Almost every day after practice, Jalen will stay after and shoot, catch and shoot threes, and it was really nice to see that work pay off. You know, I tell our players all the time, there's a relationship between work and results, and not just in basketball, in life. You get what you want, and you get what you work for. And uh, Jalen spends a lot of time shooting. And I'm just really proud that he had some results tonight that helped our team win. All right, back at the Jack Stevens Center on Thursday. Um, how important is it to have a great crowd out for this one against Louisiana? Well, it's everything. It's the one common theme in all college basketball teams that compete for championships is to have a good home court. In my opinion, we have the nicest facility in college basketball. we got a great city. We just need people to come out for these next two games and help us. You know, our students aren't going to be back yet. We just really need the community's help to try to protect our home court in these next two games. All right, thanks, Coach. Thanks.